Hey everyone, it's Marguerite Ashton um, from Building Dollhouses from Scratch. I just wanted to touch base on a few topics and make this a very quick video, <laughs> as quick as I can. First of all, um, I want to say that I have an upcoming book, so I've been working on that and edits are coming up pretty quick. But I do promise to make sure that the roof for the conservatory is completed and the videos will be posted on that as well as for the ice cream shop there will be the ice cream shop will not be completed but i did receive some comments and requests regarding some extra steps especially um, for those who just purchased the um the dollhouse kit for the ice cream shop and are looking forward to um, more information. Second, I've <laughs> I have received um, questions regarding why I do not professionally edit my videos. First of all, it takes away from the one on one that I do during the video when showing steps regarding putting together a dollhouse kit. I mean, I do not think that it's needed. I don't, if, if I drop a paintbrush, if I lose an item from a dollhouse kit, you're gonna see it. I'm not taking that out. I think that the important thing is we're here to do, enjoy, create, and make um, our projects what it is that we wanna be. One of my phrases that I use a lot is what works best for you. And for me, I said, what works best for me, I'll say that because whether it's colors, um, regarding for the dollhouse kit that it doesn't give the traditional look or if you're changing for flooring if it's something different for lighting etc that's okay that's okay and this is about i've encouraged from the beginning that this is downtime this is a distressor busy parents busy students i understand it all and that this is the one time where we get to work on something that is not pressure related and time sensitive, that it's okay to just relax with it. For me, doing dollhouse kits, that's my relaxation. It's my distressor, it's my downtime. And um, I shared those with you guys, because it's neat. I think the best thing out of putting a dollhouse kit together is what happens and how it looks once it's completed. So I, you can't beat that. Also, from the beginning, I have never stated that I was a um, professional hobbyist. I stated that I'm an amateur, I am starting from scratch, literally, and I'm learning. So any research that I do, I work to share it with you guys. Anything that I am learning in the process, I share with you guys. And um, who better to go to than my husband who works on model railroads and has for years. He does model railroading and it has been such a learning experience working with him, which again, he'll be sharing and doing some videos and we'll be adding to this. This is for fun. And that's what I will continue to keep this. I do, we do very much appreciate um, the subscribers that are currently here. And I understand if it's not comfortable for you because I, choose not to do something your way. But I think the most important thing 
is all about everybody taking a moment and enjoying the project that they're doing. It's for fun. It's for creativity. And I just want everybody to find some sort of gift, whether they're sewing, crocheting, dollhouse kit, um, putting one together. I mean, there are so many arts and crafts and it's so much fun to do it, not under pressure. So that's it. I'm wishing everybody the best and I look forward to more creative videos and um, comments from you. Everybody take care.